Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech. And if you're looking behind me, those are some cute little Tinkercad dinosaurs. I've got an idea for a fun project, so let's get cracking. All right, friends. So I created this lesson yesterday because I had some eighth grade girls that were creating awesome dinosaurs and other animals, and I wanted to share those techniques with everybody. So if you haven't seen that video, I will put a link up above so you can get at it. You can find the skills, and then my goal then my goal is for you guys to look up a dinosaur you think is cool, use these techniques to make it, and then my favorite end of the project would be if you finished your design and used the share technique so that you could send me a copy of it, and then I will try and 3D print and eventually show off your cool project, or if you create one that is not 3D printable, I will explain the techniques that would have made it 3D printable so that we can all learn and have fun while making awesome dinosaurs or even other creatures. Just remember, if you're designing for me, we've got that seven centimeter limit for how far it should go. And if you ever have something that is just printing in thin air, notice these legs would get to right here and then they would start printing the belly. I need you to make the little supports. Remember, we always make those four on the bottom so that they adhere to the bed. Use techniques like drop. Make sure you do angles like we did with this head so that it's printing upwards so it has a better chance of being successful but just use all the things that i put in that other video so that you can create your own awesome dinosaurs all right friends so just remember if you create something epic what you do is go to send to scroll to the very bottom and you invite me to check it out when you generate that link you copy that link and then you can share it with me at facebook instagram or Gmail, I am HL Mod Tech. You can also reach out to me at HL Tinkercad on Twitter. The last place you can find me is on the HLModTech.com website. So when you visit the HL Mod Tech website, you'll notice that the 3D printed dyno is at the top. You can also switch to the Tinkercad page, and if you hit end at the very bottom are my 3D printable projects. And then I also want to show you, you could hit the messaging and quickly add your personal information and a quick note. And when you paste in that link, I will be able to open your project, check it out, and I'll even be able to leave you little notes inside the project, letting you know how cool I think it is, or I could also share tips that would make it print better. So my friends, my dinosaur is probably closest to the brontosaurus, but you guys have got so much room to play and then challenge yourself to solve things, like how would you print these tiny arms if you're trying to make a T-Rex? All right, friends, so as you're thinking about dinosaurs, don't forget things like clip art dinosaurs. Just looking at this picture, I should have a second sphere on top of my dinosaur where I put the eyes in. That's such a simple fix to make it look more cool. Also, things like horns, if you're trying to make a triceratops, these are also a great place to look as you're coming up with ideas for how to make your dinosaur look more epic. All right, friends, so I hope you join in, have some fun, make some cool dinosaurs, and I'm looking forward to seeing some shares. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you've got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.